Hi, this is DarkFox127 and welcome to a Corinthia Tower development video. I haven't actually done a video in quite some time for Corinthia Tower and a hell of a lot has changed since then, not just in the mod itself but also in my skills as a modder. So I've learnt a little more about scripting and a hell of a lot of other stuff and I'm going to use it to make the tower better. Uh, as you can see, nobody before this video would have actually seen this tower like this. Uh, quite recently, within the last 48 hours, I decided I was going to change it. And by change it, I actually decided to start from scratch, fresh sort of um, mod completely. Uh, kept the other one intact, the original version, which hasn't actually got released yet. Uh, I apologise that it's been a while. Uh, I've been quite ill really uh, still not 100% but I have decided I will continue on with the Corinthia Tower mod amongst everything else that I have been doing sort of smaller mods and as you can see like I said a lot has changed uh, the lighting still needs improving but uh, the middle part was sort of a, a giant circle but the meshes were stretched way too much on the item that I sort of created that out of so I decided to shrink that down a little bit well not shrink it down sorry uh, change it completely in design looks a hell of a lot better still kept the dragon in the middle and I've actually added a really nice feature and it's the windows here I found out that I was really struggling to sort of clutter this place up and struggling to to fill the gaps in with anything relevant and it just seemed like random rubbish being placed in and now it gives it a much sort of nicer more open cozy feeling which, which takes away the feeling a bit of what I was trying to grab back from Frostcrag Spire it's a little little more lively I think it's, it's probably changed for the better but as you can see yeah completely redesigned it it does still look uh, similar like it was before but really changed quite a lot and there's going to be a lot more detail in it I'm not ready to reveal every feature yet but there's also going to be changes in sort of the features that I have announced up on the website and all you might notice that it does look a little fancier so this is really a, as far as I've got in terms of visual building and the next development video that you'll see will hopefully be of the upper floor up here which is the library which I have started work on and the library is another really interesting change that's going to start looking really good so technically the images that I uploaded the other day on my Facebook page which I think is really the only place I've put them so far they're actually out of date now but they do still represent what I'm sort of planning to create. So I hope you enjoy the video, a nice little look around the tower. Uh, there's no no features to reveal but future videos may reveal a, a couple of nice interesting things. So thank you very much for watching. Please go and check out my antisocial and my main website. So antisocial websites, main website. Uh, also you just follow me on Facebook if you really do want to keep up to track my mods and stuff and if you do want to know if I eventually join the Nexus then everything gets posted on there I don't really use the Twitter much so follow all that click all the like buttons please go ahead doesn't uh, doesn't cost you nothing just a couple of minutes of your time so I hope you enjoy it I hope you look forward to seeing the rest of Corinthia Tower as it gets created and I will speak to you next time